GLSENKIRCHEN, Germany, March 3rd, Max Meyer of Schalke reacts during the Bundesliga match between FC Schalke 04 and Hertha BSC at Belton's Arena on March 3rd, 2018 in Gelsenkirchen, Germany. Photo by TF Images, TF Images via Getty Images, Max Meyer has completed a move to Crystal Palace after being released from Schalke. He has signed a three-year deal with the club. Schalke say goodbye Meyer wasn't driftwood that the club wished to dispose of. He was an influential player, making 24 Bundesliga appearances last season. Indeed, he even started his senior career at this club, making 146 league appearances since 2013. At first, Meyer played as an attacking player, and he did score goals. However, he has since been converted into a deep-lying midfielder. He has relished getting stuck into defensive duties and can now perform playmaking roles from deep. His then-manager Domenico Tedesco deserves credit for spotting this tactical change. A young, adaptable player is such a precious thing to have in the modern, constantly evolving game. Unfortunately, Meyer argued with the board after criticizing the sporting director Christian Heidel, a relationship that was strained further by high wage demands. He had even had arguments with his manager Tedesco. His actions here rather marred his otherwise sparkling beginning to his career. Meyer ascending Crystal Palace at just 22 years of age, Meyer is full of potential. He now arrives fresh-faced into the Premier League with the opportunity to take his game further. Crystal Palace finished a rather plodding 11th last season in the league. Their summer transfer window has bought in Vicente Guaida from Getafe so far and Sheku Kuyate, and they now target Maxime Gonalons. This new signing of Meyer will help to bolster the squad and add some quality. If they can hold on to Wilfred Zaha and grab Ruben Loftus-Cheek on loan again, then they may be able to have a much improved squad indeed. As aforementioned, Meyer is a useful player to have around. He can play across multiple positions which may work to Palace's advantage later in the season. If he plays as a defensive midfielder then his unique skill set will really bolster their squad. Every top team has a player capable of pulling the strings from deep. Meyer could be that player for Crystal Palace. Germany it is clear that this player has the potential to do great things, integrating with the national setup so early on in his career. He has represented his nation from U15 to senior level, even playing in the Olympics. Unfortunately, he has not represented his nation at the World Cup yet. But, that will surely come if he impressed at Palace. To make a proper breakthrough into the Germany team is a difficult one indeed. They have the likes of Tony Cruz, Sami, Kadira and Ilka Gundogan to name just a handful. However, Meyer does have the advantage of time and age. He also has the advantage of a disappointing World Cup performance from his nation. If any time is ripe for a young player, it is now. Joachim Lowe will be seeking to improve his squad to compete at Euro 2020. There is no allowance of a similarly poor performance from the national side. So, this opens the door for change. Meyer definitely has a chance. First, he must break through and impress in the Premier League. Surely then he will go on to highest stages of football. Main photo.